Good evening, everybody. It's day 65 of my carnivore diet. Um, so today, what happened today? I'm definitely eating more now that I'm not weighing myself or tracking my calories. I, it, it's not, um, yesterday and the last couple of days, I've kind of thought it was my mind playing with me, but now I'm definitely eating more. I don't know what impact that's having, if it's having any, but I do find it interesting and I'm still not comfortable without tracking everything. Um, I just feel, it's really weird, I just feel adrift and it's quite unsettling and I, I do, going back to what I said yesterday, I do think it has to do with there's a there's a bit of control and when I'm tracking everything I feel like I'm in control and I know what's happening and I can kind of correct or whatever if I need to and it it, it helps me feel like I, I'm doing I know what I'm doing when I'm not tracking everything it really I don't know it's weird I just feel out of control um, and I'm not eating bad food. I'm not cheating. I'm not doing anything differently than I did before. I just feel like I am, I am eating more. And I think that's just because I know that I don't have to write it down. So somewhere in my mind, I'm like, okay, well, I can have an extra few peanuts than I would normally have because I'm not writing down how many grams I've eaten. So I'll just eat some more. And Ultimately, I'm not sure whether that's going to be good or bad. So I guess time will tell. And if I get to the to, to Monday or to the end of the month, I, I kind of said, I said I was going to wait till the end of the month, didn't I? Um, okay. When I get to the end of the month, I guess, the, you know, the, the numbers will tell by then. Um. So we'll see. I'm still not comfortable with it. It's still freaking me out. And hopefully in the next few days, I will settle down a little bit and maybe get a little bit more used to it. I mean, it's only the fifth day of the month, so I haven't even been doing it for a week. But I'm I'm antsy even talking, like I'm wringing my hands sitting here. It's making me antsy talking about it. The other thing is my voice is still quite weak and like, I don't know what's going on with it. I don't, again, I don't know if that could have anything to do with the diet or what. I, I can't imagine that it would, but who knows? Um, so that's pretty weird. It doesn't matter what I drink or don't drink. I can drink water all day. I can drink something with lemon in it. I can have milk. I can not have milk. I can have tea or coffee. Like, it doesn't seem to matter. Nothing. It's just quite, yeah, weak and breathy. Um, I don't know if that's a symptom of something else. Maybe I should look it up and see if it means anything. But um, that's the only thing really going on. Other than that, no arthritis, no joint pain, no tendon pain, no knee pain. Everything seems to be fine. My feet don't hurt. Um, so from that perspective, I'm I'm quite happy. And, you know, the diet certainly seems to be working. Um, tomorrow, I'm going into London. I've got a big event. I think I mentioned that before. This one's at a place that I know. There's definitely places there for me to get food and things to eat, so I shouldn't have any trouble on the diet tomorrow. I am going to another event in the evening, though, where there's definitely going to be loads of booze. I have no idea what's going to be there. It's a it's a party for someone's birthday, and I suspect that that might... I don't think it'll be a challenge not to drink, because I don't really drink much anyway. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that before I go to that party, I'm going to make sure that I get something to eat so that I'm not hungry when I'm there. And that way I should be fine. So that's the big thing for tomorrow. So we'll see what happens with that. I've had some positive news on the work front as well. So I've been talking to somebody about doing some work and potentially helping them out. Um, they've got a startup company and they're looking to start to build a team 
And I had some positive news around that today. So that was really good. That lifted my spirits a little bit. And um, yeah, and I've, I've had some other good news as well. So last week was fucking terrible. This week is looking better and I'm feeling a little bit better in myself and psychologically. So that's good as well. And pretty much, I think that's it for today. I don't really have much else to report. So we will see how we get on tomorrow. And yeah, it'll be a late one tomorrow night, probably. Um, and I'm not sure. I'll be pretty tired, but I will, uh, I'll do a video anyway and let you know how I got on the events. So until then, everybody have a good evening and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.